Winston, you said a few times this year that you keep on looking to different parts of your game to evolve as a player. Do you do you feel like you're continuing to get better and better as an overall player rather than just a scorer? He's talking to me, right? Yeah. Oh. Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I've taken a lot more pride in my defense, um, and I think that has relieved some pressure off, my, off the offensive end. So, I mean – I am trying to become a more complete pit player consistently. So I feel like I've, I've grown a lot in different areas in my game. Next, we'll go to Doug Bonjour. Hey, Kristen, just regarding your defense, how much of, you know, this improvement that you've had in, in the recent month is just a stronger commitment to it? I mean, you, you obviously talked about having a sense of urgency with, you know, yourself being a junior. It's, is it just that you're making more of a commitment or how would you explain the growth you've made defensively? Um, I just say that's been my kind of focus going into the game rather than offense. And I feel like that's helped me um, just being aggressive and attacking, uh, whether it's defense or offense. But I mean, they've been putting me on their their best guard. So I've, I've definitely tried to take advantage of that just to get better each game. Next, we'll go to Alexa Filippo. Hi, Kristen. This is another question about your defense. But uh, did you kind of take pride when they gave you a player like Maddie Seagrass to defend? I mean, she dropped like 30 and 11 yesterday and obviously is a great player in the conference. And what makes her tough to to defend? And what, what did you like about how you played her today? Yeah, she's a great player. Um, I mean, she's a big guard to try to post you up, but she can shoot the three as well. So we knew that coming in, and it was a team effort to stop her. I mean, she's she's a great player. She had 30 last night. Um, so if we could shut her down, we could handle the other players as well. So I feel like we did a great job as a team today in stopping her. Next, we'll go to Patty and Rob. Paige, hey, uh, Gina was saying that he feels the team is just now kind of figuring things out, rounding into form, understanding what the coaches have been wanting all season. So where has that growth been in, in your opinion? And do you feel the same way? And what has that done for the team's confidence? Yeah, I think we're playing our best basketball right now. Um, ever since our loss against Arkansas, we, we, we tried to find a positive out of it. I mean, we all hate losing, but I felt like it was more of a lesson than anything. Uh, we just really started picking it up on the defensive end. We started really honing in on offense and just all the little details. And I think we learned a lot from that game. And we just try to keep learning each and every game, each and every practice. Um, but I feel like we're just making great momentum strides right now, um, playing our best basketball, really focusing on the scouting reports and what our game plan is and trying to stick to it each and every game. Um, so, yeah, I would agree with him in that we're playing our best basketball right now. Was there one sort of aha moment where you guys did something and said, oh, that's that's what the coaches were talking about or that's what they mean? I think it's just every day in practice. Um, there's a lot of those moments for us because they're really smart coaching uh, coaching staff. Um, so just sort of like listening to them and really trying to focus on the details and little things and clean up our mistakes. I think those happen every day in practice. We'll go to Sunil next. Thank you. Uh, question for Paige. Uh, Paige, uh, congrats on the win. Uh, team high, eight assists. I think overall the team had 18 assists. Can you just talk about a lot of give and goes? I mean, it just seems like everybody knows each other on the court and just as far as that unselfishness. Can you just talk about that? Yeah, I mean, that's just like our team, really. We don't care who scores, who gets assists, who gets all the credit. Um, we're really selfless as a team. And in order for us to win, we have to have great ball movement. And I mean, that always happens uh, when we were, when we're winning, we're getting a lot of assists and that's just been a really big key for us is getting the ball movement, the off ball movement, screening, um, rolling, everything like that. So I think when we're playing together and as a team and we're all looking to get each other open and just be selfless, I think that's when we play our best basketball. Next, 